So we are just about to head into St. John's, which is like the major city on Antigua. Waiting for a taxi, it's just started raining. It's gonna be fun, isn't it? Not yet. <laughs> yeah, let's go do some street photography in the rain. TV whilst you're driving? <laughs> All right, we made it out of the resort. Welcome to Antigua. Uh, we're in St. John's, this is Heritage Quay, and uh, we've come at uh, quarter to five. Um, so we're just gonna catch a little bit of time and uh, hopefully get some photos of some of the buildings. There's a lot of color about, uh, which is what we've been all looking forward to seeing in the Caribbean. So uh, yeah, let's see what we can find and see how it goes. Hopefully this will be a whole vlog, otherwise we'll attach it on to the vlogs that we're doing on the Jelly Journeys channel, um, which you would have seen previously anyway. So of course I am with Ellie, at Ellie Things on Instagram, and two lovely ladies over here, when they turn around, Shu and Flora, I'm just going to introduce you. So I am with, what was, your, what was your new song? Flora Baker, the content maker. The writer maker. The writer maker. <laughs> good song. And uh, Deja, Shu. Sure. <laughs> you can't see me so much for the vlog already. <laughs> Go check out your shoe tube. My shoe tube! Oh, uh, do you know what I used to say? Hop on the shoe shoe train. <laughs> can you then I realised that, that it can be taken the wrong way. So now I could just say, come on the shoe tube. <laughs> so now it's even worse. <laughs> I think it's worse. Anyway, we're in St. John's. <laughs> Is the dog still following you? Um, I'm not sure. <laughs> we may. Look, look at the dog. Let me smile. Oh. I say it was the morning of like play, but they probably do have the play. Uh, just for reference, by the way, I am shooting with the Fujifilm X-H1 with the 50mm f2. Um, the only other lens I've got with me is my 23mm f2. Uh, that's just in my bag. And um, yeah, the other thing to point out is why we're in Antigua. So if you hadn't seen previous videos, uh, or follow me on Twitter or Instagram. Uh, so we came for a mini conference and uh, it was all kind of like organized with the tourism board and stuff. So we haven't really had any time to properly explore. Uh, so we're just making the most of what we can with the hour or so that we've got a spare uh, right now. So yeah, and we've also got a few stray dogs that are following us. So I think they're gonna, they're gonna be with us in the vlog in the background. <laughs> Bless them, they're so helpless. Did you just get one of that guy? Huh? Did you get one of the guy that passed? Yeah. Did it look good? Yeah. Yeah. Shoom. And it focuses. Oh, very nice. Very nice, very nice. Good. He was like the perfect guy to walk past. Yeah, I know. around exploring a new city there's always like one of a few different criteria that a city has as its sort of like feel and character it could either be shapes patterns or light um, or sometimes texture and this is definitely a place that's got texture there's a lot of like just texture in the paintwork and other things um, so yeah St. John's is a texture city previous uh, locations I'd say uh, or rather some future locations, so the next place we're going to be going to is Rotterdam. Uh, looking at the architecture of that, I think that's going to be a shaped city. Uh, if you have any other categories of cities, then uh, leave those in the comments below. But uh, something I always think about when I'm exploring somewhere new. No doggy. So yeah, this reminds me of that painting, but what was his name again? The I think it's Magritte. I think it's René Magritte. Magritte. I'm clearly a very expert artist. <laughs> um, I think it's Magritte. The one with the, uh, so we got the... Oh, the, just in front of his face. Yeah, the bowler hat and then the tree in front of his face, just like the apple in front of his face. And also, of course, it's London, so it's very gentlemanly. Is it banana pizzas? No, it's just cool big banana, but it's to be the best pizza in Antigua and it's actually better than Italy. Is that the nickname of the guy then? Big Banana? Might be. 
<laughs> okay, so I've just switched over now to the 23mm f2. Uh, by the way, I'll leave a link in the description to these lens hoods that I picked up. They're pretty cheap uh, and they're nice and uh, metal. Um, and they're just kind of like a bit of a, like, I guess a shorter design but wider fit um, than what the standard one that comes with it. I just like the way it looks. Uh, and it's metal, so it's uh, maybe a little bit more protective. So far I think I've got three or maybe four shots of two fellow, uh, fellow, oh my god, <laughs> two telephone boxes next to each other. Um, maybe I can make a little collection of this. The phone boxes come in twos. They definitely do around here. Um, yeah, it's just nice, a little bit of symmetry. And uh, you'll probably also notice, um, and I've been noticing this a lot myself recently, I shoot a lot in vertical format. Uh, I just, I really find it comfortable shooting vertically. I love like alleyways and straight lines and other stuff. Um, and also it's a good thing that Instagram is uh, mostly, or rather it's better equipped for portrait images. Um, so yeah, I've been uh, doing that a lot, but I've also noticed it a lot in my, in my photography style. I probably should uh, leave the food bit for your video. Yeah, You're gonna cover yeah, this, right? Yeah, obviously. <laughs> yeah. So I've actually tried this one before, but we keep being given it in goodie bags, so I'm guessing it's like good stuff. Susie's hot sauce, and can drizzle that on my meat lover's pizza, enjoy it, and we're all very excited right now because we've been dreaming about this pizza since I heard about it yesterday. So apparently in Antigua, this is the place and one of the best restaurants, and also one of the best pizzas, better than Italian pizza. Now I love Italian pizza, so I'm gonna see for myself, and look how cute the packaging is, it's actually looking at a pizza slice. And then, ready, ready. <laughs> Alright, pizza done. We've now got 20 minutes before our taxi comes and picks us up. And uh, that was by far one of the best pizzas I've ever had, by the way. But if you want to know more about the food, watch it on Shoes Channel. Go and check out Shoes Channel. Uh, she is one of the most passionate foodies and creators um, that we know. And I uh, love hanging out and seeing other people who are. You know, just passionate about sharing things and creating content. It's amazing. So do go and check out our channel and go and subscribe. And I'll say Joe sent you. She'll like that. He's waiting for you. I think I'm just going to go back on something I said earlier, um, where I said that I think this is a textured place. It's this is a colour place. This is uh, definitely an area where you're walking around choosing where you want to go based on the colours that you see. I love places like that. Hey. <laughs> We've got about. <laughs> one minute until our taxi comes to collect us. So we've got to walk back and uh, head back to the resort and uh, the rest of the conference itinerary. But um, yeah, it's always nice to come out and explore with other people and just enjoy shooting together. Whether you actually get shots or not is uh, secondary to it, to be honest. It's all about just going out, enjoying your time, being creative and exploring a new area. <laughs> All right, it is dark. Uh, so we've made it back to the pineapple. Um, that's the name of the resort, by the way, it's not natural pineapple. And um, yeah, that was a, a great quick session uh, going around St. John's, getting a few shots. I think we've definitely got some that will go together in uh, a nice little roundup post of Antigua uh, that would of course be on the blog. And um, it's also inspired me to look into more cities that have that colorful characteristic. Uh, one that's on my mind quite heavily at the moment is Cuba. Um, or rather Havana. So uh, yeah, keep that, keep that in mind. Anyway, um, so I'm just going to end this video and say thanks for watching and uh, make sure you do go and check out the others that we were with today and uh, they will all be linked in the description below. Go and give them a follow, go and read Flora's blog, uh, check out Shoes channel and of course check out Ellie on Instagram too. And I will see you in the next video. So thanks for watching, bye bye.